Hey guys, it's Zach from the Concon channel, and in this video, I'm going to show you where all the Yotsuya collectibles can be found in Rise of the Ronin. One of the first collectibles that you're going to find is a treasure chest. Now, it is going to be at this very last building along this road. So all you need to do is come to where I'm standing and you'll see it's the typical treasure chest building. Now what you need to do is come to your left and climb up onto this building right over here like so. Once you're here, you're going to grapple up and then you're going to be careful and fall onto this ledge right over here. Once you're inside, you can loot what's ever at the top here and then you can go down and you'll see that the chest is in the back of the middle of the room and you can open it up and you should get a silver bayonet so the next collectible that you're going to find is a cat which can be found in this location right over here now you can come to where i'm standing as you'll see it's the cat will be in this tall tower now what you need to do is actually climb onto this thing over here once you're on you can grapple across or just jump across and then you can climb up the rope to get all the way to the top and once you're at the top you can go ahead and pet the cat so the next collectible that you're going to get is a Veiled Edge banner which can be found right here at this building on the hill. Once you're here at this red building you'll see the Veiled Edge banner and you can go ahead and just raise the banner. Now the following collectibles that you're going to get is the Public Order, the Fugitive and the Veiled Edge banner. Now in order to unlock the Veiled Edge banner you have to complete the Public Order. Now after you complete the Public Order it will be automatically collected. And obviously in order to complete the public order you need to defeat the fugitive so you can go ahead and defeat the enemies once you defeat the fugitive you should get a rusty key and once you defeat all the enemies and the fugitive in the area the area will be restored once you have completed the public order the failed edge banner will also be automatically collected so the next collectible that you're going to get is a treasure chest now you needed to have defeated the fugitive in order to get the rusty key to open up this door once you have the rusty key you can come to this building and open up the door and you'll see the treasure chest and you can go ahead and open up the treasure chest just like this and you should get the immigrants garb now the following collectible that you're going to get is a shrine which can be found at the top right hand corner of the area now in order to get the shrine you actually need to go all the way to this veiled edge banner so if you have this veiled edge banner you can just teleport but if not you can just watch my video on ushigo collectibles to get this veiled edge banner but once you get this Veiled Edge banner, you can just teleport to it. Once you are at this banner, you are going to look towards the shrine, which is over there. And you're going to jump and glide all the way across until you reach this gliding mechanism. And once you get to the gliding mechanism, you can glide even further. And if you have the boost, you can obviously just fly all the way. But if not, let me actually just show you if not. So if not, you're going to come all the way down here. You're going to use this grappling hook to climb up here and then you're going to go across you're going to jump on this ledge and just start grappling all the way around until you get here and then once you're at the shrine you can go ahead and pray at the shrine now the following collectible that you're going to get is a cat which can be found at this location right over here by this building now the cat is going to be sitting right in front of the building but it is going to be a sleeping cat so just be careful i'm crouching around very slowly as i've already scared the cat a bit but you can just go ahead and pet the cat the next collectible that you're going to get is a fugitive now he's going to be sitting in the corner of this ditch and as you can see he's sitting right over there drinking something but i'm going to try and sneak attack him so you can go ahead and take out the fugitive that is the fugitive defeated so the final collectible that you're going to get is another treasure chest now it's going to be right next to where the previous treasure chest was um in a small little building and at this building you need to shoot the barrel in order to get inside so once you have shot the barrel you can go inside and you should see the chest right here and once you have opened up the chest you should get a scroll of intellect it's been zach from the concon channel i hope you guys enjoyed the video and thanks for watching